Okay, the greeting. The greeting, when you call someone to, to set an appointment or make a sale, you have to nail this. Like this is the this is like the most important thing. Because if you don't get through this, you're not getting anywhere else. This is where you put them at ease, where you gain control, where you differentiate yourself from others, where you gain common ground. This is where like the magic happens in your sales process. So you're if you're an insurance agent or, or you sell something else, that's totally fine too. It's it's all the same. So in the greeting, you want to really differentiate yourself. You want to hit someone with enthusiasm. So think about this. People get solicitations or calls for sales all day on the phone. So you want to make sure that when you call them, you are different. All right? You want to separate yourself. You ever get a call from a telemarketer, right? It just sounds so bland. There's no enthusiasm. They're probably getting paid a certain amount an hour to make a certain amount of calls waiting for someone who's just waiting for them to call. <laughs> Which if you sell insurance, you know, that those people aren't like waiting for us to call them, right? We have to initiate that. So the way you separate yourself in the greeting is this, enthusiasm, energy, and excitement, because you only got a certain amount of time. I listen to insurance agents make calls all day long. And the, the greats, separate themselves from the ones who struggle for in their greeting right off the bat. They're like, hey, Betty, how you doing today? Right, like, like you're their friend. You wanna like seriously just be like all in on the greeting here in the introduction, excited, enthusiastic, not like over the top where you sound like you're like on meth, but like, r like right underneath it, okay? You wanna be genuine. Look for something that you like about them. So when you see the lead or you see someone you're ca they're calling, like look for something that you like about them. You may like something about their address. You can relate to something about their name or any other information in the lead. If someone's born in December, hey, we got the same birth month, right? If someone's name is like Janie, uh, I'm gonna look up like Google Janie. Oh, I like that name, it's got kind of a ring to it, right? I got a friend named Jamie, just like Janie, right? Oh, you live on Blue River Road. Dude, I would love River Monsters, the TV show. Whew, that's my favorite. So like any little things that you can use to like them and get on common ground, be like, oh, you Blue River Road. Uh, you ever watch the show River Monsters? Like just kind of just like something to just separate yourself because no one else is going to do that, right? Now, it may be a little off topic of what you're trying to sell, but it's going to separate yourself. It's going to get them in a different mindset and they're going to give some pushback too. Now, when you hit them with that, that energy and excitement, People are like, man, this guy's interesting. This girl's interesting. They may have something that can help me or hey, phew, they make me feel good. They made me laugh and smile. They created a little endorphin rush in me. So I'm gonna stay on the phone and talk to them, okay? So anything you can use to do that, make them laugh, make them smile, be excited. I'm here to help, put them at ease. They're gonna hit you with some resistance, right? Oh, I already have insurance. Hey, that's awesome. I'm not asking you to make any changes. Look, I'm in this for the long haul. I'm gonna get you more information than you'll ever need for this type of thing. And I'll be a great point of contact. And we're gonna have a good conversation along the way. Keep going. Or I already have insurance. <laughs> Dude, I love that. My, my favorite person to talk to is someone that already has insurance. Keep going. Like whatever, I'm not interested. Hey, look, I, I totally, I totally get it. And if you were interested, then I, I, prob I probably wouldn't even have a need to call you and keep going through it, okay? So like anything you can do to differentiate yourself and separate yourself from everyone else who's calling them. Mega important, mega important. Like you may feel like you're, it's an act, you may feel kind of corny doing it, but it really is an act, right? Like you gotta learn the lines and you have to learn your your thing. And, and, and so what if that's not how you call your friends or family, right, or whatever? Like this is how you call your clients. You wanna communicate you want them to feel at ease and welcome and you want them to feel good and happy. So you have to understand that you are you have to cause that in them. They're not just gonna feel that way. They're gonna be on guard. So you have to create an effect in them with your voice, the things you say, and how you say it in your greeting.